is one of six-year-old Kyle Alton's favorite places to go. It's that wine time! His family comes from the eastern shore to Severna Park. It may seem like a long way to travel, but this is a special gym for special kids. Yeah, it's a lot less chaos, and for him, because his brain kind of, you know, goes here and there, it's to keep him focused and on the task is, is better. Kyle has a rare genetic disorder called NF1, and We Rock the Spectrum Gym is the right place for him to play. One of the things with him is he has really low core strength, um, so we're, we're taking him to OT for that. And a lot of the equipment here is the same equipment they have at their OT training, um, so it's definitely helping him build his core strength. Um, which makes him more confident. The equipment is designed for kids with sensory issues. If I see that mind working. After a career of teaching kids on the autism spectrum, Courtney Cahill knew that there was a need for a place like this. A lot of parents feel like they can't take their children anywhere. Here, you know, they can come in and we accept it. We accept it, we, we let it happen, and the parents don't have to be nervous. The writing is on the wall. This is a place where you don't have to apologize for being yourself. Some kids might not be ready right away for the physical activity and the equipment, so there are other areas where they can play. For example, there are costumes, and there's also arts and crafts. They can sit quietly in a corner and play with puzzles or cars or trucks. We have things they can draw. There's something for every kid here, so they can play and parents have less worries. In Severna Park, Megan Pringle, WBAL, TV 11 News.